Yesterday, fire engulfed Hima Cement Factory in Kasese District, killing at least three people and injuring at least six other people. The dead were then transported to Fort Porto Regional Referral Hospital for DNA tests to ascertain their identities. Just a day after the inferno, officials from the National Building Review Board, led by the Executive Secretary Engineer Flavia Buire, today inspected the factory and according to her there is need for the factory to implement the occupational safety guidelines that the government put in place. While addressing journalists, Buire said that she could not reveal the findings at the moment because there were still some bits of information that were missing. She however revealed that a comprehensive report will later be shared. There were works going on. We are yet to pin down the cause of the explosion, the cause of the accident. We are yet to pin it down because there's a, there are a lot of bits, missing uh, bits that we need to put together to arrive at that cause of the accident. So it is really so preliminary in nature. Preliminary investigations indicate that the fire that started around midday might have been caused by electrical works on the pipeline connecting to the fuel reserves. From the information on ground is that three people lost their lives to the incident and then there were two inju uh, eight injuries of which three were critical and the other two were discharged. The board has since requested details of the company that was subcontracted to do the electrical works and whether it had skilled personnel to do the work. Earlier, our team in Kasese was able to see some ambulances that were lined up to transport the victims to Kampala and a handful of workers, majority being from the security department at the site.